Hello, this is Wayne Barron from Dark Effects TV here to bring you another exciting tutorial. This one is how to import a comma delimited file into Excel and then format the cell to display all the numbers within a zip code. And the default cell removes the beginning zeros. And in this case, we are importing a partial list of all the zip codes within the United States and New York and other states have zip codes that start off with double zeros and we do not want them to be removed and the default cell will remove these so in this example we're going or we're going to learn how to format the cell to not remove these beginning zeros uh, so let's go ahead and get started so with Excel open you can either hit control zero or I'm sorry control control O which will open up um, your open dialog and then choose zip.txt and then once it opens up it's going to say delimited or fixed width and so in our case we're going to leave it as a default delimited which is characters such as commas or tabs separate each field then let's click on next and then choose comma and then as you see here it splits them up for us and then click on finish now as you can see here it starts off with our 401 which needs to be 00401 so in order to format our cell so that it does show our 00 at the beginning and which as you can tell it's not to all of them it just goes down to uh, down to here so we've got about 1783 lines that needs to have the zero zero at the very beginning of it and so how we do that is that we go up here to the top make sure that it highlights our A field and then we right click go down to format cells go down to special make sure that zip code is chosen then click OK and as you can see here, it has formatted our cell, and now it displays our 00, zero at the beginning. So once again, let's close this out. Don't save. We're going to import, which is Control O. Choose our zip.txt file. Leave it default as delimited. Click on Next. Choose Comma. As you can see, it separates each one of them click on finish right click on the cell that has your zip code in it go down to format cells choose special make sure that zip code is chosen click OK and there you go I hope that you enjoyed this quick Excel tutorial and uh, y'all have a rocking week and uh, upcoming weekend thanks a lot